Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is super exciting. I have a handbag unboxing video for you. So this is a bag that I have actually been wanting for a really, really long time, but I didn't want to pay full price for it. And I thought, what is a way I can get this bag without paying full price? So I don't know if I told you guys, I did a video recently where I sold a bag on fashionfile.com. So they are a reputable website where they buy and they sell pre-loved luxury handbags and they guarantee the authenticity of the bag. So I sold the I sold a bag and I had really, really good luck on there. And I thought, you know what, let me just kind of peruse the website and look at some of the bags they had for sale. And I saw this bag that I'd been wanting for a really long time, but like I said, there is no way in the world, I love handbags, but there is no way in the world I was gonna pay full price for this bag. So I thought, you know what? I said, let me just try to purchase this bag pre-loved and see how it turns out because they do have a 30 day return policy. So that is exactly what I did in the bag I'm talking about. It's the Christian Dior Lambskin Canage large lady dior i'm so sorry if i butchered the name but i just got the box in the mail and i wanted to run home and immediately unbox it so i have to tell you a funny story so i've been tracking this package and i got an email today when i was at work and it said ups has a package to be delivered today and then it said the dreaded two word signature confirmation and i said so I messaged my neighbor, she's actually one of my good friends, her name is Katie, I messaged her and I was like, have you seen the UPS man, can you tell me or can you message me when you see the UPS man? So she was so sweet, she messaged me about like 9.30 this morning and she was like, the UPS man is here, I said, can you do me a huge favor, can you go to him and can you see if he will give you the package? Tell him the number and I was thinking to myself, he's probably going to recognize that address because he delivers Ulta and Sephora, well, let's not get into that, but anyway, so she said he was there and he gave her the package and I was so thankful because otherwise I was going to have to, I knew I wasn't going to make it home in time tomorrow because they never come during the window they say they're going to be and I just, it was going to be a big hassle and I was worried they were going to mail it back. So anyway, to make a long story short, she got it for me. She had it at her house and now I can unbox it for you today. So I have my little opener. I have yet to see it. So we are going to inspect it and we are going to kind of open it together and we will see what we can find. So first off, if you guys are new to my channel, make sure to hit that little subscribe button. And if you want to see me unbox this Lady Dior, then keep watching. Okay, I'm going in. Okay, so I'm really excited. When you open it, it's, just, it's like this looks like fashion file and it says used is the new new. Now guys, I've never purchased a previously loved handbag before. I wanna try this out. A lot of other YouTubers have purchased bags and I've seen them and they look really nice and they've brought up good points. It's like, you you know, you don't have to pay an arm and a leg for this stuff. Well, don't get me wrong. It's still expensive, but not as much as you would pay. So I really wanted to try it out. So it comes in this fashion file dust bag. Oh, I'm like a little nervous to open it. I don't know why. Um, for some reason, whenever I get new handbags, I get like, like nervous to open it and excited. Oh, let me breathe for a second. I'm really excited about this bag and I just hope it turns out the way I want it. Okay. Okay, so this is the bag right here. Like I said, it is the, I'm going to do an up close. It is the Christian Dior Lambskin Canage Large Lady Dior. And again, it also, it comes with the tags attached right here. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to leave the tags on just for a couple of days until I make sure this is what I want. We are going to inspect the bag together. If I don't like it, then you can return it within 30 days. So I'm going to keep that in mind. So I picked up this bag. It is lambskin. And when you buy from the website, it'll tell you if it's in very good condition. It'll tell you if it's in excellent condition. It'll tell you what's wrong with the bags. So here is the bag up close. It does have the silver Dior hardware. Now, the one thing that I did notice, there are some scuff marks. Some wear and tear. There's a little bit of wear and tear on the edges. Not too bad. Like on the bottom, you can see there are a couple marks. But I was like, you know what? You're not, you're not really going to see that. You notice the most wear and tear, I'll be honest, 
is on the plating. There is a lot of wear and tear on the plating, but other than that, it's in great condition and it is a beautiful bag. And the thing that I love about this bag, you can wear it like this, or it does also have a long strap where you can wear it kind of over your shoulder. Oh, it's really, really pretty. Really pretty, I like it. It's definitely is smaller than I thought. I don't know why I thought it was a little larger, but the bag is land skim and skin and it has the geometric black leather. Very, very sturdy handles. Like I said, if you, um, it has the your little logo right here. Nice, let me see, let me check out. So. On the lambskin, there are a couple little scuffs, but it's not too bad. Like I said, this bag was a quarter, a quarter of the price that you would have paid full price. But the zipper, it has a top zip right here, and then it has a little CD silver thing. And I like that it has a zip. I didn't realize it had a zip. Um, you open it, and on the inside, it has some bubble wrap on the inside. And it has a Christian Dior pocket right here. It has the red geometric on the inside and the side of the bag looks pretty nice with a couple little minor scuffs but not too bad. Yeah, I'm very, very happy with this. And the good thing about buying from Fashion File is the 30 day return policy and then on top of that, if you decide to hang on to it, but then you're, you know, after like a couple months or a couple years, you're like, you know what? I'm just not really feeling this bag anymore. You can sell it back and they'll buy it back from you. Now they won't buy it back from you for what you paid, but they will buy it for you for a little bit less. So I thought that was good. So I just really, really wanted to try it. The bag is not in perfect condition but I think it's absolutely beautiful. It's a classic piece and I will be honest, the one that I really, really wanted was the Dior Mini. So it's kind of like half the size. I thought it'd be really cute, but it was way too expensive. Even the previously loved bags were way too expensive. So I thought, no, you know what? I, I really, I'm going to, I'm going to get this one and I like it and I had sold the bag. So that's kind of what I'm going to do for now. And if I sell a bag, I'm going to buy a bag. And again, this was my first pre-loved bag and I'm really, really ple pleasantly surprised. They do a great job on the website of taking pictures and they give you up close pictures in case there's anything wrong with it. So I'm going to make sure to link the fashion file website down below in case you guys wanted to check it out. But I'm really excited about it. a lot of other YouTubers were talking about fashion file and they were talking about their good experiences and they brought up a lot of good points about buying pre-love. Some of these bags are just crazy expensive and if you can get one that's in really good condition, I don't see anything wrong with buying pre-loved. I definitely don't. So again, let me show you the bag again. Very beautiful. It comes with the strap. Here is the other side. I don't notice much wrong with the leather other than a little bit of fraying on the sides. And the major wear and tear is definitely on the silver hardware, especially in the back. I'll try to give you an up close view. I know it's gonna be hard to see, but so far, I am very pleased. Super cute. Super cute, you guys. So yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like handbag videos and you like me kind of changing every now and then for makeup, make sure to leave it below. So thank you guys again for joining me. If you have any questions about this bag or anything at all, make sure to leave it down below. I love you and appreciate your support so much. Thank you again for watching and thank you again to my neighbor Katie for making this possible so I could get my bag in time. Yay! So I'm very pleasantly surprised. So again, I will leave a link to the Fashion Fire website down below. And then also, if you are interested in selling your used bag, I will also link my video on Fashion File and how I did that. I kind of take you through the steps of um, what I did to sell the bag, and it was so easy. Have a good day. Thank you again. I will see you next time. Mm -hmm.